delighted to be here. Also thrilled that uh, illustrious international players like uh, Shubham, Neha, Mr. Rizwan, they are there. Basically, such a facility should be blessed by sports people. So the fact that they have all come here means a lot to all of us. And uh, these are very promising and exciting days for uh, table tennis in uh, Hyderabad, in Telangana. Our uh, uh, players are doing quite well. Day before yesterday, in the Khelo India uh, tournament, which is going on in Gohati, Fidel Snehit from uh, Hyderabad, he won the championship. So, <clears throat> and he has been winning quite regularly. Similarly, Srija, Akula Srija has won in Ajmer recently, one of those uh, UTT zonals in, uh, in Indore or Ajmer. I think it was in, in Ajmer. So, she's doing quite well. She's uh, showing lots of promise. and. There are quite a few others as well. Harsh Lahoti is there. He's a part of the Delhi University team now. Stephens, yeah. So he's uh, promising. And so many others are there. But obviously, the more uh, uh, coaching you get and the more uh, tournaments you play, the more exposure and the more kind of learning opportunities we create for such players, the better it will be th for them, for their performance. And uh, in that context, these kind of centers uh, hold importance. But the model which I'm looking at for Hyderabad is that while these are important centers where we identify promising talent, but these eventually work out like a hub and spoke model. So these are spokes, satellite centers, two good players here. We have also identified some uh, other facilities. The MLR College has a good, good facility. Meridian School has a good facility. We have created something in Kukatpalli, you might have, uh, you have, you have yeah, Somnath is uh, coaching there. So, multiple such centers and of course the old ones in the city like the Gujarati, Seva Mandal and the YMCA and all, they have their own legacy and their own distinction. So, all these centers, of course, there's enough number of players, even having six centers or ten centers will not be enough given the kind of uh, interest and the number of promising players who are into table tennis. In fact, table tennis is, uh, in some ways, ingrained in our DNA. If you go to any corporate office in our uh, Cyberabad, in our IT hub, every office has multiple table tennis uh, tables and for recreation, lots of employees just to unwind, just to relax. But of course, many of them are talented, there is promise and therefore they need to be kind of guided and shaped further. So the hub and spoke model in which we identify lots of bright children, youngsters in these centers and eventually they reach some place where the highest form of maybe international coaches or the best Indian coaches etc are made available to them. So hopefully that will happen in uh, Yusuf Kuda, the stadium that the sports authority has. So, But nevertheless the fact that good quality facilities have been created, this was missing in this part. As I, as I said, we have something in Kukatpalli, something in Banjara Hill, something in Sikandrabad, both YMC and Gujarati are in that area. But this area, this, uh, uh, you know, the Sanikpuri, the larger A.S. Ravnagar, Sanikpuri area. So this will be a very important addition. And I would like to congratulate uh, Ashish in particular, because uh, this is not uh, his day job. He works in a responsible position, but his passion for the game and his uh, desire to give back and to contribute back, that matters quite a lot. So this is a very uh, praiseworthy example. I would uh, encourage everyone else also to emulate this. First of all, support this institution. And most importantly, see if you can bring, uh, identify children who are good at table tennis and get them enrolled here so that they, are, they get a fair opportunity at developing their game. So once again, uh, Thank you very much for uh, inviting me to, a bar to be a part of this function. Good wishes to all of you.